Hi guys, so I have a huge Timu haul for you guys. This is about two or three orders that I'm putting all in one. So I have a lot to show you. So sit back, relax, grab your favorite drink, and let's get going. See what all of the, the goodies that I bought. <laughs> so this is one. This is the first thing. This was a desktop storage drawer and I bought it for $2.39. Now I think I got this one. You know how they give you like a like a code, not a code, but they'll send you like an email or a text or something saying that you can get something for 90% off or something like that. I think that's what I used this one for. And so I got this. I'm still reorganizing my stash so look at this isn't that cute it's a really good size let me see can I measure it I'm gonna measure it's um 10 it's 10 and a half by 7 it's 10 and a half by 7 and this is it's all plastic and then I guess you get it from down here but look at that and then so you can get them and stack them up. And so I really like that. I really like this. So you see, it has a little grooves and everything so that you can stack them up. So I might end up getting more. I got one just to kind of test it out before I decided to get more to use to kind of um, organize my stash. So there's that. Next I got, let me open this bag. Don't you love these bags? Sometimes I get them, sometimes I don't. But I have another big thing in here. Let me just dump everything out. Like I said, this is a pretty huge haul. I've been kind of collecting my things so that I can give you guys a really good size haul this time. This is a nine drawer mini storage box and I paid $5.78 for this. And let me get my, my little handy dandy cutter. I love this thing, isn't that cute? Also from Timu. And let's see. I only took things out so that I can get the pricing on them so that it would be easier for me. I think I need scissors for this. And this is just a mini one. Nine drawers, look! Oh, that's cute. And it's so funny because it has these little um, holes in the back so that you can hang it up if you wanted to. Huh. That might be a good idea. Use up some wall space, right? Instead of using up my my um, my table space. Let me open this. I want to see what it looks like, like with the little drawers and everything. Wouldn't it be cute to turn this into those little apothecary? Um, little drawers with the little handles they put like a little wood here and then they put like a little handle maybe paint paint this um brown or black Ooh, they're a pretty good size these little drawers they're very good size wait let me see there we go so it has nine these would be really cute to put like all the little doodads right that we have what, what what's happening here why doesn't this want to come out? Oh, oh, it has this little, it has this little stopper thing. Look, see this? It's got that little stopper thing so that you, you won't want to take it all the way out, but okay. You can still, but I really like it for five bucks. Not bad. Okay, there's that. Then, um, other things that are really not crafty related, but I wanted to share with you anyways. I got this. We're redoing my daughter's bathroom. And um, I just thought that this would be cute to put on their drain. So it's just a shower drain cover. 
37 cents is what I paid. And so I just thought that would be cute to have on their shower floor. <clears throat> then, because winter is coming, I thought I had another one. Oh, yeah, here it is. Fall and winter. So I bought these. I love wearing the fingerless gloves. And so these are just the cutest thing. Look at how pretty these are. Oh, there's a little hole. I was looking for the thumb hole. <laughs> I was looking for the thumb hole. There it is. <gasps> cute. Little sweater. Isn't that cute? These were $1.97. And they're just called the white knitted gloves. So again, I will always have everything linked down below with the pricing and the link on Timu. And I also have a code, you guys. I have a code that anyone can use if you're new to ordering from Timu. You can get 30% off of your first, I believe your first and second order if I'm not mistaken. But I'll have all the information linked down below. So make sure that you use that code so you guys can get an additional 30% off off of their awesome prices already. But isn't that cute? So I got the beige in that one. And then, so these are fingerless, no, with no fingers. And these are the half finger in black, $1.28. So I wanted to get two different kinds. Now this kind, I can actually crochet myself. Of course, not, <laughs> not like this, no way. But I can do just a basic stitch. But I thought that these would be cool, like when I'm driving or when I have to be out and about or something. I just, I like to have my fingers free because I feel like my fingers slip. But I like those. I like these too. Isn't that cute? So there's that. I think that's the only, oh no, I have one more thing that's not crafty related. So let me show you that. I am a cardigan wearer, always. In the heat, my house is always cold. <laughs> so I wear cardigans all the time. But I love the cardigans that have pockets. So when they don't have pockets, it bugs me, right? And the ones that I've been finding that have the buttons don't have pockets. So I love the chunky cardigan, like to wear over clothes. And so for those sweaters, I bought this. Is that the cutest thing? So you clip these to either side of your cardigan, and then you just hook it closed like this. And so it stays closed. Is that the coolest thing? So these are, um, it's called a flower pattern retro sweater clip for $1.98. Is that not the coolest thing? So I just, they have them in the gold and, and silver, and, but I got this um, antique gold look. So got that. I love that. This is going to come in super handy with all of my cardigans. All right. We'll just put that to the side. Okay. I'm just throwing things on the floor, guys. Now let's get into the paper. This is... Flower texture handmade paper. You get 30 pieces for $2.47. Again, I thought that this was larger sheets, but for what it is, it's cute. I love how they put the little the little piece there, but look at how pretty. Oh I don't want to have to take this off, but I feel like this is the way I'm gonna be able to show you better what exactly we're looking at look how pretty these are look at that the leaves it feels like I don't know it feels like I don't know it's I can't even describe it like thick tissue paper maybe look how pretty that is oh my gosh look so you get them in the beige you get them in this taupey craft brown color. You get this one. Ooh, look at the swirls in that. That is cool. 
Love that. You get more of those. So you get this bunch has a bunch of different colors. Let me see this one. So here's this one. Oh, look at those. That's pretty. I wish they were bigger sheets. That would have been a lot cooler, but it's fine. I could still use it. Look at this one. It looks better on this. Look, not that pretty. And then you have this one that just has a lot of little dots on it. Can you see that up close? There you go. So you get those. So that's really pretty. I love that. So sticking with the handmade textured paper. Let me put this off to the side. I'm going to have a lot of stuff off to the side. I bought this. This was nine, piece of, nine pieces of A5 rainbow hollow texture tissue paper for $2.69. And I'll try to link everything according to how I'm mentioning it, I guess. So here's this one in purple. Then you get this one in kind of like a turquoise teal kind of. Here's a chocolate brown. Here's like a crafty brown. You get this pink. I feel like these are better to use like when you're doing those um, glue books when you want to have like a little background or something. These are beautiful. Love those. Okay. Found this. And this is called um, Thickened Antique Deco Edge Paper. You get 50 pieces of handmade bamboo pulp raw paper for $3.48. So let's see, I don't see a deckled edge, but let's see what it looks like. Mm, no, I don't see. No, they're not deckled edge, but look at how cool this is. You, you can see it kind of has lines, it looks lighter in the on the camera but ooh, that's neat let me rip a little piece ooh, ooh, it rips like butter oh my gosh it rips completely along each little do you see those lines let me see you see them it rips perfectly along that line that is so cute i love this yeah it wants to rip against the line Look at that. Wow. Oh yeah, that's pretty. That'll be fun to add in journals. So there's that. I'm trying to keep all the packaging together. I found this and I thought this might be fun to kind of keep on my desk when I'm showing like certain crafty things. This is a large silicone mat. It was 314 and it's 15.7 inches by 11.7 inches. So it's a pretty good size for $3. Right now I'm using one that is pretty tore up already and it's like that turquoise. I think it was um, the We Are Memory Keepers, that turquoise color. But I wanted to get something, another, I wanted to get another one. And when I found this one, I think they have them in different colors. So I got this one in black. Ooh. Oh my gosh. I'm going to make a bunch of noise trying to get this out. I'm not going to bother. But look, it's like a shiny on one side and it's matte on the other. Wow. Yeah. Very rubbery. Oh, wow. That's cool. I love the size of this. Isn't that great? Love that. Okay. Next, I got some A6 background paper. And this one is 24 pieces for $309. And this one is... Uh, it doesn't say what... It, and this one doesn't this one doesn't have a name 
of what the style is. But let's see what we'll call it. The other one does, because I bought two. This one does not have a name. Should we just call this this one the dark? We'll call this the dark set, okay? So let's see, isn't that pretty? Okay, here's this. I love this size. So you get two of each. Look at that. I love how dark these are. Oh, wow. Hmm. Not sure about that one. But I do love these. And they're a really good weight. Let me see. Does it say what the weight is? Um, 160 GSM. It's called, it just says heavyweight cardstock. 12 different designs. So, yeah. This is a really good, a really good weight to this. Love that. Oh, look at these. These look like the, the vintage um, typewriter buttons, right? And these. This is like just the newspaper kind of. Oh, what is it? Oh, no, like a dictionary. It's like a dictionary. That's cute. Love that. So this is going to be the dark set. The dark A6 background paper. Let me write that down before I forget. I'm going to put dark. Okay, so there's that. Then this one is actually called the Wonderland background paper. So that's this one. So let's see this one, see what, what this one looks like. Again, it's 24 pieces for 309. This is more of a lighter. Look at that. <clears throat> Excuse me. So this one has roses and feathers. Very pretty. This one has a lot of birds. That's pretty. I don't have anything really with a lot of birds on it. This is cute. We can cut these up. Make six different little ephemera pieces that's cute look at how pretty that is yeah this is really pretty i feel like it was the wrong way and then there's this this is just a background very cool love that okay there's that let me get the last bag and this has everything else and it is full full I'm just putting everything off to the side I do have a few things that are multiples just different design but let's see okay so, okay, these two are the same. I just got them in different ones. They looked kind of cool. They look like pockets. So this one is called Butterfly Concerns, uh, 40 pieces for $2.48. And let's see, let me put this back on. So they're pockets, right, yeah. So they're pockets, look at how cute those are. But I believe the center part you can actually rip out and you can make them into like little window pockets. So let's see how that works. Um, yeah, I'm trying to, there it goes. I feel like because I'm rushing, it's not <laughs> it's not letting me do it. Okay, let's see. I'm trying to hold it down to get a clean cut. So you can do this on both sides. 
because I did I did see the pictures so there's that so you can use this for something and then here's this one so let's just take this out just as an example so you guys could see what you can actually do with these because these would be cute for like little slides if you wanted to so let's keep ripping this down I'm not doing the best job in ripping these out but of course you can clean it up later so you can use these for something else just like a little ephemera pieces and then you have this and it's a little pocket so you can actually put maybe um, acetate and put like a, a washi sticker in the middle or something so like that you'll you can see it on both sides and you can just kind of stick this in a little tuck spot so that would be really cute that's what I'm thinking about using mine for but that'd be fun so there's this one again this one is butterfly concerns you get 40 pieces for 248 and then this one is called endless journey again 40 pieces for 248 so let me just show you these I don't know if oh I didn't show you the other ones I'm gonna have to check to see if they're all the same or oh these got stuck together so let's see uh, looks like you get five of the same one two three yeah four five so you get five of the same but aren't those cute this one even says field notes on there so look there's that one and then you have this one let's see the other one i didn't even check the other one i just that was my fault for assuming that they were all the same so here's that one that i just ripped up then you have this one you have this one and then you have this one very pretty okay there's that uh let's see i got these these are uh, 30 pieces boxed postcards. This one is called the Travel Memories for $3.98. So let's see what this one looks like. I think I'm going to keep this on here so I can remember how to, how to word that. Ooh, this has like a suede cord. That's cool. I'm trying to, how in the heck? <laughs> What's happening? It doesn't want to pull out. There it goes. Ooh, very cool. This I could throw away. Ooh, I like that closure. Yeah, I've done that type of closure before. Okay, let's see what these look like like I need more postcards I just thought that these were very cool look at this look at that follow your bliss and don't be afraid and doors will open where you didn't know they were going going to be youth means limitless possibilities reality very cool travel memories I love the way this has like that deckled edge love that Let's see, are they all different? I think they are. Look at that one. They all have like little sayings on them and they all have the, yeah, they all look the same on the back. So here's these. Let me do it this way. Let me hold them and then do it this way. So I like that you get different colors. very cute they are glossy they're super thick look at that love that look at that 
this one? Oh yeah, it was this way. Here's another one. Oh, I like that you get a few that have like that rigid edge. Look at this one. Distressing around it, make it look super old. These are fun. Yeah, I really, really like those. So there's the postcards. Put this, see if I can put this back in. Just so I don't have everything flying around everywhere. Come on. Okay, there's that. Then let's see what else we have. Okay, I got these. These are more of the, I did haul some from a pop shelf. These are just the um, date stickers. It says 365 day 12 piece pack stickers for $1.97. <clears throat> so these were actually cheaper than the ones that I got from pop shelf. But I actually forgot that I had ordered these, so. You get every month. I can probably start using these the beginning of next year. So I like the numbers on these. So those are cool. What else? Um, no, these are all the same. I'm gonna put those just off to the side. Let's do these. These are digital, they're called digital labels. 56 pieces for $1.78. And I wanted to see how these compare because supposedly they looked on the website. Isn't that cute? That little pocket. It looked like on the website it was um, they're like number, like number stickers. So let's see. They're like just little. Oh yeah, see. But of course I would cut around that edge. There's. It does say stickers, right? Oh no, digital labels, so they're not. They are stickers. They are stickers, guys. Perfect, that's even better. So here you just get a bunch. I love these. So it looks like you might get a couple of each. Yep, these are good, very good. <laughs> yeah these are super cool I'm not going to go through each one but at least you kind of you kind of get an idea of what they of what they look like you get some <laughs> math problems but these are really good yeah and the color of them are perfect so there you have it love those absolutely love them again let me just quickly put these back in just so again i won't have everything getting everywhere okay next ah oh, look at these these are washi stickers these are 50 pieces and it's called the plaid girl because they have different ones. 248 is what I paid. And look at those. Can you see? These are cute. I think I got another pack too. Let me see. Yeah. Look how cute these are. So you know I have the retro ladies the retro men I don't have any of the little girls and so when I saw these I said no I gotta get them they do have different ones but I just got the plaid so look at her and her little plaid look how cute these are they're all in little plaid outfits these are adorable it says that they're washy so let's see yeah they're washy so I would probably just stick it on a white piece of paper look at how pretty she is look at her they're all gorgeous 
I love that they're little girls. I can add that to my stash. Look at her, her little headband, her little coat, her little pigtails. Oh yeah, very happy with these. And they're such a good size. They're such a good size. Oops. So it looks like you get two of each. Did I see that already? Yeah. Very cute. Oh, look at her, the little glasses. Okay. There's that. Then I got another set, and I believe they're little flower. Their dresses are floral. This one, their outfits were um, plaid. But again, they had different ones, so you can choose. I think they had colored ones. I just wanted to get something that had a little bit of all the colors. So here's this one. Yeah, this one's called a floral skirt. Again, 50 pieces washi stickers for $2.48. So there's a glimpse of these. How cute. Looks like they might be numbered. This one is number seven and this one's number eight. So I don't, I don't remember how many different sets they had, but they did have a lot. But look at these. The little flowers. Some look like flowers, some look like polka dots. Look how cute. Oh, yeah. Her little, no, don't know what animal that is. I was gonna say a dog, but that doesn't look like one. Very pretty. Aren't they cute? Let me come closer so you guys can see better. The babies. Very, very cute. Love, love, love these. Might have to go back and get some more. Look at her with her little nighty. <laughs> so cute. Yeah, love those. Now I need to be on the hunt to see if they have little boys. That would be cute too, right? These would be cute to put on little tags and um, little labels. Oh yeah, we should make some labels out of should we tell me should we make some labels i have that vintage um paper the like the pattern paper that i showed you guys the last time let me show you i have a couple of these should we make like labels or tags or something with these you know what i'm I'll make an excuse to make a tag. <laughs> so if you guys want, we can make big tags. We can make little labels. We can use some of these. Do something very girly. What do you think? Let me know. Let me know if that's something that you guys would like to see. That'll be fun. Do something girly. Something very, very um, colorful. Next, I got these. These are... Uh, 45 piece, pie, pieces, <laughs> 45 pieces of vintage washi stickers. And this one is the British style. I know that they did have about five or so different sets. Look at these. So these are all going to be like picture. I feel like these were very Tim Holtzy, right? Love that. So you get, it looks like you get three. Yeah, and they're washy, so they're going to be thin. So if you want them to really stand out, you're going to have to stick them on white paper. So you get these. How pretty, right? And the size is really good, too. 
them dancing. Yeah, these are just like portraits. So sweet. And you get these, them, and them. Here's these. Look at them. Love that. So cute. And those. So this is the British style. Put these back. Okay, I'll just keep that together. And then this one is called European Lady. Again, 45 pieces for $1.41. Sorry, a huge truck just went by if you heard it. So let's see this one with the ladies. But even this is cute, isn't that? Look at this, this alone. Oh, I'm trying to get them all. Look at that. That is so cute, make a tag out of that. So these are just vintage ladies. So again, you get, uh, look like three of each. Look at that. Very pretty with a little flower on the back. Yeah, these are gonna be fun to play with too. Ooh. <laughs> Her little pose. <laughs> this one's beautiful. Her hat. Yeah, very pretty. I love the border around these, aren't they? Isn't that cool? And her and her. Very cool. They do have other ones, guys. They do have other sets, so I only got two. I thought those were fun. Okay, next, let's do these. This is 300, this is the, probably the most expensive thing that I got, but this was 300 pieces, uh, decorative stamp stickers for $7.89. You guys know I'm obsessed with stamp stickers and I like to use them in my, um, in my projects and, cause you can get, I think you can get them individually, like, separate packs if you don't want all of them or you can get the whole thing i just got the whole thing i said you know what I'm, i know that i'm going to be able to use them so let's see star map riddle are they all named lady yeah so this is the star map riddle wow this smells a lot like um i don't know it has a strong um, scent to this. I don't know. I don't even know what it smells like. Like glue or something. I don't know. But there's these. These are cool. Let me see. Let me peel one and see how thick they are. Because they are stickers. But I think because they have like this um, jagged edge, you might want to use, yeah. Ooh, but they're nice and thick. They're nice and thick and they're matte. That's what I like about them. Oh yeah, these are good. These are really good. So you have these. I don't have a lot of things with the moon and the stars and all of that. So this is kind of fun to have. Oh, I think this goes this way. So very spacey, love that if you have any type of project that you need little things to decorate, this would be perfect. Look at that, the crab. <laughs> very cool. Okay, then I am going to put these back because these cannot be shuffled in with anything else.
then we have this one this is called the ladies bouquet so again these are all stamps ladies bouquet on this one you get 50 pieces in each and you get two of each so these are pretty i just love how thick they are so we're going to do these really quick that's cute i love that with the sewing machine oh <gasps> that's so cute those are beautiful. I love the colors on these. Look at her hat. It looks like a lampshade. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. These are really pretty, though. Love that. Very shabby, right? Very shabby chic. Oh, cute. That's really cute. Yeah. Very pretty. I love the black on that one. Okay, so there's that. And put these back in. I told you this was a long one, guys. This one is Travel Scenery. I was kind of getting low on my stash of stamps my stamp stickers and so I wanted to kind of replenish and then this would be cute too to put like in little projects in like the in like little little pockets you know what I mean that would be really cute too just to kind of add these into pockets leave them as is and if you're going to gift it to somebody let them stick it on wherever they want it look at those that's pretty oh I love this set actually I love them all so far they're very, very cool. Again, these are just scenery ones. That one has like a little ship on that. Very cool. The little car and the hot air balloon. <clears throat> okay, so there's that one. Let's put this back. This one is called Distant Mountain <clears throat> Plant. Excuse me. My voice is scratchy. Okay. So these are pretty. These are just botanicals. Very pretty. I love that they give you different sizes and shapes. Love that. Very pretty. Do they say what kind of flowers is on there? No. Aww. Strawberry. So pretty. I feel like I've seen some of these images before. But they're very cute. There's that one. What did I say this one was? Distant Mountain Plant. So got those. We're almost done, guys. This one is called Pet Time. Hmm. I don't know if I would have gotten this one. I don't really like... I don't really do a lot of projects with pets on them, but these would be cute to kind of give as like little freebies, right? Because they are cute. Look at that. Aw, they are cute. The cats and the dogs. Oh, bunnies. Look at that one. So pretty. <laughs> they got this one all dressed up with the hat on. The bows very cute yeah they're cute <laughs> looks like it's carrying their baby the baby kitten that one's pretty
Happy birthday, this one says. Very cute. Oh, here's the horse. And then it has a lot more cats than it does anything else. So if you're a cat person, or even not, because they're just they're just cute. So I'm really not mad about it. And this is the last one. This is Flying Insect Adventure. So let's see what kind of bugs they have. Butterflies, of course. Birds, dragonflies. Birds, butterflies. These are pretty. The birds. More butterflies, birds. Looks like the majority is birds and butterflies. These are really pretty too. I really, I really like the whole entire set. Super pretty. Yeah. So I think it was worth it was worth my money because I really do use these a lot in not only in projects just to kind of like you know space fillers but I also like to give them um, I'm gonna start giving more things like this for my freebies and my I'm gonna keep this I just keep this for my um, my Etsy shop so that'll be fun Okay, let's see what else. Um, let's do this one. This is, what is this called? It's called, it's a four pack and it's called Mushroom Farm, $1.98. And I believe they're just little tickets, but I just thought that the mushroom little deal on these are super fun. So let's see what these look like. Um, I'm trying to see how I take these out. Because, oh, they're on the plastic backing. Oh, I love that. Look at that. Isn't that cool? This is the little packaging it came in. But look at these. <gasps> they're so pretty. And they're nice and thick um, paper stickers. Oh, those are beautiful. There's that. So they are different. Love those. Then you have these. They did have different ones. I remember that. They did have a lot of different ones, but I just got these because I just love the green in these. And then the mushroom little houses I thought were so pretty. $1.98 for these. Let me just quickly put these back. Okay. Then, oh, sorry. Then let's see. Oh, let's do this one. See, here's another little thing that we could use for the tags and and um, little labels and stuff. So this one is it's called Book Time Papers, eighty sheets for two forty nine. And look at how cute this is. It's called Retro Children's Book. And it's just a little book of papers. It is, it, they're not stickers or anything. And let's see. Are they all different? Looks like they're all different. And it looks like you get two different color sheets. They're like little paper dolls, some of them. Is that not the cutest thing? Look. Most of them are paper dolls. And then it has little poems, <laughs> the little pictures. Oh, these are cute. Then you have those with the ladies. Very cute. And then you have more of the little paper dolls. Oh, I think, okay. So I think they're the same, just in the brown. Yeah. So you get the same. It's the same in the beige and then the same in the brown. So there's that. But I thought that was really cute. Super cute. We can do something super girly. 
that'll be fun. Then let's go into, let's do this. This is just 50 pieces. They're called PVC Anti-Oxidation Plastic Zipper Bags. Phew, what a mouthful. This was $5.47 for 50. And I got these because I have like the little basic little baggies, like these things. But sometimes I need something that's a little bit more sturdier than just these because I get these at Dollar Tree. And I'm, I mean, they did the job, but I just thought if I can get something that's a little bit more better. These are actually supposed to be for jewelry so that the jewelry doesn't rust or something when they're in here. But I just really liked these. And Diana had actually given me some hers were a tiny bit smaller so she gave me look on in my happy meal she gave me these and i loved them and so i thought you know what i'm just gonna order the bigger size and yeah i love these so these are going to really help me with my my storage when i need little baggies for something this is just a little bit more permanent and because they're thicker I can actually, they have them actually stacked up, like standing up, like in a little um, container thing. So I'm thinking I might do that too. Find a really cute wooden one and stack those in. That'd be fun. Okay, the last of the paper. Yeah, the last of the papers are these. And these are just going to be a quick flip through. But look. It's, I think I got almost all of them. I think I might be missing one or two, <laughs> but I got them. They're called um, tickets. So this one, they're all 100 pieces. They're all $1.77. And this one is called Express Train. So let's see this one. So they're all the same. See, you get 100 of these, but look how cute, right? So that's this one. I don't know if I'm going to be able to put the... Oh, yeah. So there's that. Then I got this. This one is called Environmental Tickets. Those cute. And let's see. They're pretty thin weight, but they do have um, a little bit of texture to them. So those are really fun. So got those. I'm trying to see if I can stick everything back in. These are just called green tickets. So I've got these. Uh, too much. These are just called yellow old tickets. I just thought these were fun to have. Got those. This one is called train number eight. So here's that one. And it looks like if it's perforated, but it's not. So you got those. This one is called self-service receipt. So here's these. This one is called City Express. Again, these look like they're perforated, but they're not. Very cute though. I love all the different colors of all of these. And this is the Blue Bill. So there's these blue band bus service so very cute they're all different widths they're different colors different sizes love that okay there's that let me show you the stamps that i got i got four i got four different stamps so here's this one this is just called the word pad stamp for 249 and it just looks like a um What are they called? Clipboard. It's just a clipboard. Is that too cute? Love that. 
This one is Retro Ads Stamp Set, $1.78. So here. Retro Ad Stamp Set. Look at how cute those are. So they're all like different little ads, like for the paper. Then you have this little buckle, this little round one style. That looks like a button. Uh, it says fashionable and the um, dictionary meaning on that one. And then this one says fashion frocks. <laughs> That's really cute. Aren't those beautiful? Love that. Then I got this one. This one's called Protractor Pattern Clear Stamp 224. So this is more of just like a background stamp which I love. I just thought that the numbers and it just looked really cool. Doesn't that look neat? That's going to be fun to play with. So got that one. And then this one is the one that oh, I keep forgetting. Was it is it Leslie? That told me she sent me an email and said this is the one I was talking about when I said that I wanted the world stamp like the map and this is the one she got that when she showed it to me I said oh my gosh I love this one better and so this is this is it I told you I ordered it thank you so much for sharing that with me isn't that beautiful I love this I love this so neat very detailed so this is going to be fun to play with too so got that and then let's see what are these oh these are stickers i got these for 32 cents it's 40 pieces so let's see these are a pet aren't these pretty the roses just pink roses so it looks like you get a couple of each very pretty I like putting these on my envelopes if you've if you've ever received um, a package from me then I love to use like little things like this aren't these pretty it's so pretty the roses very pretty got those for 32 cents very very good I think they had other ones but I don't remember if I chose these or if this is just what came so because sometimes you just kind of get whatever they have but either way I love these these are really pretty I should just hello take that off it's getting in the way so let me put those back put that and the last couple things let's do this this one is mixed random um, skeleton keys 20 grams for a dollar 34 now I don't know why I think I got trigger happy <laughs> because I have a lot of little skeleton keys and so I don't know why I got these because I still have a lot but there it is. So here's these. They're actually really pretty. I really wanted some that were like this that had like that greenish tint to it. You see that? That made them look very, very old. But it's okay. I can still use them. They're still really pretty. So got those. And these are 20 grams for $1.34. I think you can get 20 or 50 I remember something like that so there's these Let me put these back in very cute and then I got these and these are just called um, vintage alloy zinc charms a hundred grams for four dollars so let's cross our fingers that we get some cool ones so these are they're just called vintage charms, but let me see. 
I don't remember. I think they all have some type of wording or something. This one says warrior. This one has like the compass. Can you even see that? Put a compass on it. This one says something on it. This one says best friend. This looked like it would be like on a, because it's shaped like that. It looks like it would be on a friendship bracelet or something. Look at this one. I think this one just says handmade. JK. Then you got a lot of little ones. These say love. This one says, uh, I can't read it. But let's see. Oh, this is a quote from Marilyn Monroe. This one says, give the girl the right shoes and she can conquer the world. Marilyn Monroe. Believe in love. You get a couple of those. You get some more of the JK. What does it say? Handmade. What? Why does it say handmade? And then in the back it says JK. Doesn't JK stand for like, just kidding? But these are cute. Handmade. You get them in different in different colors. They're just like little plaques or something. Dream. So I think so I think these are more like for friendship bracelets or something. Because the way they're shaped. So you get some of these coin ones. Yeah. I think I had high hopes for this one and and I'm not I'm not too thrilled with it. I might use some, but other than that, I don't think I don't know. I don't even know if I would keep them. Yeah. Then they have a lot of tiny tiny ones, but I don't know. We'll see. I might keep a few. Some of them look cool. The handmade ones are cute, but it's got the two, the two little holes on them. So I'm not sure how that would work. So I don't know. We'll see. Maybe I can put those on journals or something. See? And then a bunch of little tiny ones that say handmade. But all right, that's it, you guys. I told you it was a long one, so I try to prepare you in advance. But thank you so much for watching. Thank you for, oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, one more thing. These are vintage, uh, 50 pieces vintage clock stickers. Oh my gosh. Let me just go through it really quick. And then I'll be on my way and let you guys go. But these are fun. I think they're all different. Ooh, look at that one. I just thought that the clock faces would be fun to have. Just a quick, a quick flip through. Yeah, these are pretty. All right. That's it, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Thanks for hanging out with me for this past um, hour or so. And don't forget to like, subscribe. I do have all of my coupon information down below in case anybody's interested um also um i'll have all the links to everything that i purchased um also down below and um if you guys have any questions just let me know otherwise i will see you guys in the next one thanks so much for watching guys bye